Got a situation. There's a new killer in town. I'm just doing some other work on another killer that has a blue face and he's mutilated a bunch of people. Some are saying Jeff the killer's back. Shouldn't we just kill these guys? You remember Carver? You remember the way he got so angry after his family got killed? We're not gonna go down that way. Where was this new killer last sighted at? Not too far from here. We should head down there and take a look. Dead. We, 
I want to search out now on Tobias Rogers. I want it ASAP. Hello, detective. We should talk. Regardless of your failure, you are nonetheless a proxy. You will forever be known as Dicky Toby. I have every reason to blow your brains out. Give me a reason why I shouldn't. Listen, I'm back from the dead. And I was brought back from the dead by an entity known as Slender Man. Start talking. They could be close. Who's close? Better killers. These two are Slenderman's best assets. They can wipe out an entire city overnight and nobody would see them coming. Is Tobias Rogers one of these assets? Yeah, he's the new guy. If and when Slenderman gets enough of these proxies under his control, he's gonna merge his realm, the Void, into our world. And believe me, detective, it's gonna be hell on Earth. That detective Toby failed to eliminate. Chaos surrounds him. He must die. A master. What about Toby? Never mind him. He is safe and under my control now. What about the jackass with the smile carved on his face? I am already testing him, and he will seek our cause. But the detective I foresee will be a problem. Go to the apartment of the dead detective. There are the police there. Consider it done, master. Slenderman's breaking into my mind, detective. You're a psychopathic murderer already, Jeff. It's already broken. Slenderman gets in here, then... I'm a pawn in his game. I kill whoever he wants me to kill. I gotta get down to the police station. There's some kind of problem there. They're calling me in. Don't go. It's a trap. I'm telling you, man, it's a trap. What the hell are you talking about? Check the CB radio in your car. Badge number 2212 to dispatch. What's going on? Hello, detective. Please don't kill me. Let him go, you sick bastard. They're coming for you, cook. What the hell do they want from me, Jeff? Void is only known to him, proxies, and marked ones. You know about Slenderman's plan. What did I tell you about calling me by that name? I'm sorry. It was an old habit. Don't ever let it happen again, Tim. Jeff is now under my control entirely. We sent a call to the chief about Toby being at Jeff's house. What do we do when the National Guard gets involved? If it comes to that, then you two, Jeffrey. Eyeless Jack, Toby, and the other marked ones will eradicate them. Sounds like a damn war. War and chaos are inevitable. The detective is ours. Maxwell 
marble apartment complex on Hornet Road. Now. Walk away from that, you bastards. Toby and Matsky are resting. Jack came by earlier. He ran into a tree. No sign of Jeff. Master, are you sure he's with us? Controlling his mind is like squeezing a blade as hard as you can won't be able to hold him for much longer. He's too unstable. Enough being at two places at once. You need to be here. Ours. <laughs> 